Well, months after this police body camera video was, was released, and Sergeant Ethan Newberg's arrest, dozens of new charges are now filed against him. Hello, everyone. I'm Nicole Baker. And I'm Denise Koch. Well, just a short time ago, Baltimore State's attorney Marilyn Mosby announced those new charges. They include false imprisonment, assault, and misconduct in office. WJZ is live just outside of Mosby's office downtown. Rachel Menetoff is breaking us down the new details. Rachel? Nicole and Denise, good evening. The state's attorney is handing down 32 counts against Sergeant Ethan Newberg. She says he could face up to 110 years in prison for his alleged behavior. The charges against Sergeant Ethan Newberg include false imprisonment, assault, and misconduct in office. Those charges stem from nine different incidents, which state's attorney Marilyn Mosby described at today's press conference. Mosby says as part of a long-term investigation, her office has identified a pattern and practice of the sergeants harassing, intimidating, and detaining law-abiding citizens without any legal cause. Newberg was arrested in June for grabbing a man in southwest Baltimore while another officer tackled him to the ground. The man was sharing his thoughts about the officers running a warrant check and asked police to remove a man who was sitting on the wet sidewalk. Newberg was also suspended without pay. Mosby says this was one of many incidents of unlawful conduct. She went on to say that the police sergeant intimidated people who questioned his actions while he was conducting police business or tried to videotape his actions while on duty. The indictment alleges that Sergeant Newberg, acting beyond the scope of his authority, engaged in a common pattern and practice of harassment and intimidation to knowingly, intentionally, and unlawfully harass, detain, and assault law-abiding citizens for the improper purpose of dominating, intimidating, and instilling fear in the citizens of Baltimore City. The state's attorney's office says much of their investigation involved reviewing and analyzing Sergeant Newberg's body-worn video footage. They say they don't yet know what will happen to the arrests and convictions that the sergeant was involved in. We're live downtown tonight. I'm Rachel Menetoff for WJZ.